Okay, so we're really in the swing of things now. I'm going to get our next speaker on. Um, can we have Elizabeth Hayden? She's from Momentum. She's going to come and speak to you all now. Oh, she's behind me. There she is. Hello. Um, I honestly didn't think we'd have to do this. I didn't think that we'd have to stand here um, and ask to have our dem democratic rights met. But hey ho, we're here. So last Thursday, a nation used their right to vote and get rid of this despi despicable Tory government. We no longer want food banks on our streets. We no, we no longer want children left hungry. And we said, we don't want tuition fees. We don't want homeless people in our communities. We don't want police who no longer feel they can do their job because of austerity. And last Thursday, we voted for that. We voted for hope. And our hope isn't being listened to. We voted for a better future for all. And I don't know about you, but I haven't felt hopeful over the past seven years. I felt depressed and angry, and that's what's made me fight. And now we've, we've suddenly got hope, and I can't believe that we're, we're in this situation. We've said we demand a fairer tax system, an NHS that is funded, and a £10 minimum wage. I work somewhere that doesn't pay me the living wage. That shouldn't be okay. That shouldn't be okay that in this day and age, there's young people who are not paid enough to move out of their own home. I'd also quite like to bank holidays and more time off work. I'm sure everyone else would. Yeah. Four more. Four more. We voted, we didn't vote for Tories and they lost, the, lost their majority. They've ignored us. And we brought our message to the streets. We brought it to the streets on those seven weeks marching up and down in constituencies, getting people to vote Labour. And now we're bringing it to the streets again. The Tories have rejected hope. They have rejected They've looked for support from a party who's happy not just not to bring us back to the 1970s, which I personally would quite like, <laughs> but to the 1870s, to so a place 70s. where women aren't, aren't recognised as human beings. Women don't get a right to choose. This electorate did not vote for the DUP. We did not vote for a coalition of chaos. Even when Theresa May said there would be a coalition government supported by terrorist sympathisers, we didn't realise she'd be leaving that government. We say no. We say no to the DUP. We say no to the Tories. We brought our message of hope. And 59%, the majority of the electorate, have rejected austerity. We want a government for the many, not the few. Keep that going for Elizabeth, everyone. Thank you so much for coming. Um, I've now got another another singer for you. We've got Kieran Ma. He's going to do what was a protest song.